everyone and welcome to your weekly reading for January. Oh my God, I don't even know what day it is. 23rd? 23rd. 2022. Uh, this is a collective reading, you guys. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. You guys know the drill by now. Be sure to check um, out the link in the description. If you guys want a personal reading with me, you can currently use a 20% off discount code. It's the word love. So be sure to check that out. I have lots of new readings. If you didn't see my last update video, be sure to check that out. I have a bit of a different setup here. Uh, if you guys are new to my channel, hi, how are you? It's good to meet you. And if you're returning, hello, welcome back. It is so great to see you again. And always guys, check the description for any kind of links and things of that nature. If you guys aren't already subscribed, please do so. If you like it, share it. Give me that thumbs up. It really helps the algorithm, all of that business. Oh my gosh, okay. You know what, let's just get into it. We're gonna use the Tarot of Curious Creatures today. And here we go. Okay. What do we got here? Ace of Pentacles, woohoo, I like that. Um, I just heard the word windfall. Some of you might be expecting a windfall, um, a gift of money coming your way. Others, this could be something that you've been manifesting that actually comes into tangible, um, like it's actually something that you can see, touch, feel, right? Ace of Swords, oh, another Ace, okay, Ace of Swords clarity, intellect, all right? Um, some of us are getting a lot of good ideas to make money this week, or you've been working on something, you had this idea and it's starting to pay off. Okay, we have the fool. Um, I just heard don't jump. Don't jump just yet. This is a week of sitting back and letting things come to you. You don't have to chase anything. You don't have to jump for anything. Um, just wait, okay? You already have this. You don't have to act on it. Let it come to you this week, right? King of Wands, yeah. Um, that's a good week so far. It's kind of... Um, that that what's the word i'm looking for um that boss kind of energy mm -hmm. you know just sit back let things come to you like lion right king of the jungle or whatever they say about them like charismatic let it come to you you know see how he's just all confident just sitting there like no one no one is business that's that's the energy i want us all to tap into this week. You don't have to jump through hoops. You don't have to go through things, right? It's already here. It's coming to you. You don't have to chase it. Hmm. Okay. So six of pentacle page of cups. This talks about minding your business, focusing on what's in your own cup. Okay. Um, don't worry about giving to others, okay? We're focusing on what we have this week. We're not going to focus on all the things we have to do and all the, you know, things that we want. We got to do this and we got to do that. And we got to manage here and my money here and this here. And no, that's not what we're focusing on. We're focusing on that one thing, right? That ace, that what, what we want. Focus on that this week. Really watch that you're not splitting your energy, right? Keep your eye on the prize and focus on, mind your business this week, okay? Mind your own business. What's going on in your cup? That's what we're focusing on. Leaving behind the rest here with the Eight of Cups. If it doesn't serve you getting this, these aces, getting, you know, what's going to fill you up, as they say, leave it behind. Drop it. And I just heard somebody say, it's not that simple, but it is that simple, right? It's your mind telling you don't have to drop things or you can't drop things when you absolutely can. You absolutely can, okay? Yeah, 
Ten of Wands reversed says, hey, guess what? It's time to leave the heavy shit in the past. Eight of Cups, right? Leave that heavy shit that's not serving you. We have the Hermit. Spend some time by yourself this week, right? Again, stop focusing on other people. This is, this is you focusing on what's in your cup. What's guiding you? What's guiding you? That's an interesting question. What's guiding you this week? What's lighting you up? What's lighting your way? Interesting. Okay, I'm liking this. The star. See, your miracle's on its way. Your miracle is on its way. Stop chasing it. Just sit still so it can find you. Celebrations with the Three of Cups here. All right. Surround yourself with your support system who are cheerleaders. Not the naysayers, not the, oh, how do you think you're going to do that? You know, there's there's two, I know you know what I'm talking about. There's two kinds of friends here. There's the, there's the who we go to when we want that practical kind of thinking. And then the cheerleaders of, oh my God, you're awesome. Yeah, why wouldn't you do that? Uh, 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 you know what I mean? Um, find your cheerleaders this week and let them, um, you know, boost you up, or even better, when I see it mixed with the Hermit here, be your own cheerleader. Celebrate your own ideas, right? Your miracle's on its way. Just sit back and let it come to you. Walking away from anything that's not, that's not helping, that's not serving, um, Stop giving all your energy away. Keep some for yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what song's playing in my head right now? Don't Go Chasing Waterfalls by TLC. I feel like that has come in before. I'm sure I've mentioned that song before. It's, how, it's one of my guides' songs. They like it. Um, but yeah, there's no need to go looking outward. Just let it come to you, okay? Let it come to you this week. Have some fun, have some fun this week. Take the pressure off, right? We're letting go of burdens. We're walking away from it. Oh, I like this. Okay. <laughs> These guys just kill me. They make me just giggle. They look so funny. Um, but yeah, find what lights you up this week. Let it come to you and we will talk to you very soon in the next video. Bye.